Right, here's where we uh, come to discuss what uh, private means. Um, uh, basically, um, any class can access any fields and methods of its superclass, that's any of its superclasses, right up the tree, uh, so long as they are not declared as private. At least they can in theory. Um, uh, what this means is that uh, we take this example here, um, yeah, right down at the bottom of the tree is something called manager extending employee and uh, we've got a little method here called test uh, it doesn't take any parameters at all so it's written like that and it doesn't return anything and um, it's a, if you try and set uh, name to be Fred Flintstone what happens is it will look in here in this class and it won't find name in there so it'll go to the super class which is employee in this case uh, looks through there for name and it doesn't find it so it goes now to the super class of that which is person and it finds name there now because name has been declared private that means it's got no access to it and uh, that's it it'll give a compiler error and private means it's only accessed within that class and nothing else so there's no other way to get to that except from inside the class person. So this, for example, we're sending the salary equal to that. It's perfectly fine because if you go up here to here, salary's uh, not marked as private, so you can do that. And similarly for address, you can go up through here and here. The address is quite okay, uh, but not that or raise salary because raise salary is a is a method and um, if you look that method I haven't written in what it does I'll just put a few dots in there because there's not enough room on this uh, on this slide to do that uh, but uh, that method um, that method there uh, is marked as being private so you can't call it except from inside of employee that's the only place that you can call that method so that's basically what private means.